Facebook's new on Daybreak Giving Back. The Rashia Whitlock Foundation is hosting the second annual Back to School Supply Drive. It runs from uh, now until July 5th. So it's designed to help students, yes, and also save personal money spent by teachers. News 8's Katie Wisely is live at the Krista Moore House with how we can all get involved. Hi, Katie. Hi, good morning. Well, some supplies has already been donated, but of course, a lot more needs to be collected before that July 5th date. Now, I'm joined here with Purdue Polytech principal. This is Kiana Warren. Um, you've been a classroom teacher in the past. Talk a little bit about how important supplies is, and, and teachers have really had to pay uh, out of their own budget, out of their own accounts uh, to, to supply for students. So it's really important for students to have the supplies they need so they can maximize their education. And and um, some families are fortunate enough to um, be able to afford all the things they need, but many times students in the Indianapolis area don't have all the things that they need. And so that does cause teachers who deeply care about their students and only want success for them to have to use a, their own funds to um, purchase items and supplies that students need to learn. And many times that can be hundreds to even thousands of dollars that, uh, that teachers take out of their own paycheck. So um, that's why this um, drive is so important for both teachers and families in the Indianapolis area. Do you find that it's hard to get parents to get supplies for their students to take to school? Some, it's, um, and again, families always want to do what's best for their kids, but what can be really challenging if parents don't have the funds and a lot of times they don't, they want to, they may have to choose between purchasing a meal and purchasing school supplies and that can just be really tough for families. So a lot of times families want to, but just don't have the means um, and sometimes even the transportation to get those. Yeah, um, exactly. Items. We want to show uh, on screen here some of those items that are needed. Can you walk us through some of those uh, items that are being collected? It's really the traditional things. You have glue, uh, crayons, pencils, notebooks. We want kids taking really good notes. Um, our school specifically, we are project-based learning, and so um, uh, students need uh, various supplies to make sure they can um, do those really great projects. Awesome. Well, thanks so much for your time. There are various locations where you can draw drop off those donations. You can also purchase those donations on Amazon and have them sent directly to the foundation. And we will have all of that information and those addresses on our website here soon at wishtv.com. Live in Indianapolis, Katie Wisely, wishtv, wishtv.com and follow us on Facebook. Oh, they make it easy.